Hello, hello, hello. My name is Zeep. You're watching Zeep Nation, and today we're playing a fun, spooky, cute game. Uh, I forgot. Um, don't let the the background fool you. This is a Halloween esque game. Uh, apparently, it was recently reskinned for winter of 2023. So that is that. Um, I guess I'll look at the frog facts. Oh, true frog facts. A noble member of the amphibian group. Frogs are primarily carnivores, eating anything from insects to even small vegetables. Harmless. They're harmless, guys. Um, as with all the other amphibians, frogs are cold-blooded, which means they cannot regulate their body temperature. Are off the chain. Uh, diverse in their distribution... Frog species can be found in tropical to subarctic areas of the world. In outer space, I believe it. Me. That is you. Adorable. Um. Play. Oh. <laughs> looking for the giant play button on the top. Hey. Are you going to sit there in the dark all day? I might be. Why are you judging me? Well, wherever floats your goat. A uh, kiwi? Kiwi bird that's also key. What was that? Ugh. I wonder if our neighbor, Crazy Dave, microwaved his phone again. <laughs> you should probably go check it out. But don't forget, you gotta use WSAD to walk around and keep an eye on your something. Uh, when it lights up red, you can use the E to interact with it. Come back and tell me what happened after you find out. Yep. Alright, let's go. Oh, this is adorable. Santiago, hello there. Hey, go check out that noise. I think it came from upstairs. Yep, you got it. Can I crouch? I can crouch. Oh. Oh, that was just to close the door again. Oh, it is a winter wonderland. Coming sooner than you think. And we are in the EU somewhere. Where's that, Germany? Not really sure. Well, I believe the objective is to go upstairs, so... Let's just do some quick exploration downstairs here. Uh, mirrors don't seem to work. We are vampires. Um... Uh, sharp things, outlets, nothing too crazy. That's really, uh, it's really jumping out at me here. Yeah, I'll take normal for once. I'm not sure who puts a Christmas tree in their bedroom. That seems kind of insane to me, but you know, to each their own. Got a little bathroom in here. Very cool pirate ship. Hello there. <laughs> hey, you. You're finally awake. Ah, docking frog. What happened in my room? Is this a Skyrim reference, seriously? Shh, That's not important. <laughs> I know what I look like, but I'm not actually a frog. I'm an all-powerful wizard. My name's Diago. Diego. I don't remember how I turned into a frog. Like, amnesia or something? Basically, I... Frogot. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
It was a frog pun. Um, I'll ignore it. No, really, was that a Skyrim reference? If I said no, would you believe me? Um, uh, absolutely not. Yikes. So, anyways, like five minutes ago, I was a cool wizard, but then I messed up a spell I was casting, and I guess I turned into a frog in your house. I have zero memories of what happened and zero idea how to fix this. Can you help me out here? Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. Since I need to get back to my human form, do you happen to know anything about transformation potions? Um, absolutely. I've played Wizard 101 before. Perfect. I'll have you whip me up something. Even though I don't remember what I need exactly, I do remember some of the ingredients vaguely. For example, the first ingredient is something sweet. Um, I totally got this. Awesome. You need to go around your house and find some more ingredients. Bring them back here to my cauldron when you're, you found it. So, what are you waiting for? Go find me something sweet. You better hop to it. Yes, sir. Um, it's a nice magic wand, buddy. Not sure what's uh what you're burning there, but that doesn't look like a natural smoke. I'd be a little bit concerned about that. Oh, stuff is lighting up. Okay. We're on easy mode then. Donut? Yeah, that seems sweet. Um, cupcake. That's also sweet. And slice of cake. Okay. So, we got three different options. Do we need all three or do we need just one? I'll take the cupcake. Wait, can I take more than one? This is still glowing. Oh. I'll take the cupcake. The cupcake just feels right, you know? That must have been the correct ingredient. Look, my magic's already coming back. All right, what's next? I think I need something cold. I'll be here when you find it. Okay, you got it. Sacrificial dagger. Normal stuff, of course. Okay, what is this? Photo of my ex. Oh, ice, ice, cold, buddy. Let's see. Ice. Oh, gross. Your fridge and your freezer are backwards. Candle. So that's the opposite. Interesting. Okay, so let's let's go with ice. I think I think ice is probably the best bet. Wow, look at you go. I didn't expect you to be so obedient trying to do the right thing wonderful enthusiasm next i need something electronic you know where to find me when you're done okay so uh, it looks like i got my tv down there no need to go observe that pc tower that seems important plant plant seems like the wrong one Huge TV. My PC tower is red. That's like a couple thousand. This is like 500 bucks. Like, I'm... Oh, I can't even see. I feel like the, the TV's probably the best bet, right? Like, just like price-wise. If we're gonna destroy something electronic, I go with the TV. That thing was huge. You couldn't have found literally anything smaller? 
doesn't <laughs> doesn't say anything, just flex a lot. Oh man, whatever you say, no pain, no gain, am I right? With that, we only need two more ingredients. I'm gonna miss you after you're gone. Gone like when this is finished, not like dead gone. That'd be crazy, lol. For this next item, I need something green. All right, you got it. Did my vision just get blurry and wobbly? Yeah, I'm a little, uh, little sleepy, a little drowsy, I guess. Nothing to look into, I'm sure. Uh, well, that's a pear. That's definitely green. Uh, that is not. That's orange. No. Santiago, you're looking very green today, my buddy. <laughs> my good old buddy. <laughs> I got an achievement, you monster. Lovely. Did you just throw your pet into the cauldron? I mean, he was green, wasn't he? You're a scary kid, you know that, right? All I need is one last ingredient. I need, drum roll please, something sharp. Don't worry about why. It's for the potion. Just bring me back something sharp and this will all be over soon. This seems like a bad idea. I'm here for it. I'm absolutely here for it. So, we got... We got a slice of bread. And we got, we got a knife. Oh, with a little heart emoji next to it. I do love that. Here you go. Aha! Ha ha ha! Oh man. You made this way too easy for me. Anyway, probably want to brace for the fall. It'd be a shame if my dinner got scuffed up. Oh. Oh. Truth is... The game was rigged from the start. Alright. Obedient. Now I believe, uh, there are... Yeah, there are two other endings. Let's try again. Let's get the other endings. We got time. Hey, you. You're finally awake. Hold on, I'm getting serious stage vu. Oh, really? Cool. I don't need to explain this to you, then. Grab me something sweet, and we can get a move on. You got it. Donut. Griffin. Hey, Griffin. Cut it out. Let's see. So donut feels like the wrong option or as, as wrong as we can be, right? So let's, let's throw this in here and see what happens. That must have been the correct ingredient. Look, my magic's already coming back. Uh, it was hard not to eat that, though. Oh, wait. Why were some objects flowing? Because I used my frog magic to help out. Obvi. That you didn't remember anything, how would you know what to enchant? Oh. So anyway... Need you to bring me something cold. Like now. And stop asking so many questions. Kids. Shaking my head. Right, right. So the ice seems like the right one. The fire seems like the wrong one. That's a blue outline. That's a blue outline. I believe the blue means correct. So let's, let's do the candle. Because candle seems wrong. Yeah. Hey! What are you doing? 
that's not cold. I'm an agent of chaos and let the intrusive thoughts win. Ugh, since it was your first mistake, it's probably fine. But don't do that again. Next, I need something electronic. It should be a lot harder for you to mess this one up. Hmm. So, the plant would be the wrong answer. So let's do that. Hey! What did I say about messing up my potion? Better question, what on earth is happening right now? Just normal potion making side effects. The fumes and stuff, yeah. We only need two more ingredients. Go fetch me something green. Or else. Interesting. So pear is green. This is not green. This is orange. It's in its name. You can tell by the way it is. How hard is it to follow my simple instructions? Oh. Um. Where, where did the exit button go? You know what? It doesn't matter. It's too late. All I need is one last ingredient. Uh, it's something sharp. Don't worry about why. It's for the potion. Just bring me back something sharp and this will all be over. Yeah, yes, sir. Um, piece of toast, you say? Oh, weird. Wait, I can't grab that when it shifts to bad. No, I can. Okay. What is this? Oh, well, that's horrific. Oh, my bread. Oh, no, my bread. Ah, uh, I broke the game, guys. I broke the game. Oh, I threw my bread outside the window. Oh, what are you, buddy? You don't look so good, buddy. Why don't you lie down? Ho ho ho. Oh, right. Well, my bread's outside, so I guess I have to grab the knife. Um, not quite what I wanted, but, you know, it's... The door's... Oh, gosh. All right, here's the knife. Well, this is awkward. You must have messed up the potion somewhere and turned yourself into a frog too. Why didn't you just follow my directions? I forgot. <laughs> okay, so I guess we accidentally found uh, two of three. Neutral. All right, all right, okay. So let's uh, let's try that again then. Hey, you! You're finally awake. Uh, yep, sir. Stage vu. Cool. I don't need to explain this to you then. Grab me something sweet. Now, is there anything that's like the opposite of sweet? Because we tried the donut, the donut works. Um... Slice of cake would work. And obviously we've already done the cupcake. And they all have a smiley face after them, so I think... I think this should all work. This all qualifies as something sweet. That must have been the correct ingredient. Cool. Alright, what's next? 
Something cold. All right, so yeah, let's let's grab the candle again. Yes, agent of chaos. Hey, what are you doing? That's not cold. Ugh. Let's see. Uh, first mistake. Let's try again. Uh, electronics. So. We're, we're gonna do the plant, of course. Of course. Boom. I can't be stuck here forever. Uh, <laughs> you will listen to me. Got it. We only need two more ingredients. Uh, something green. Alright, yeah. So what is green? I know what isn't green, and that would be an orange. So let's just throw this in the cauldron and see what happens. Uh, very hard. I... Pff, instructions are hard. You know what? Doesn't matter. It's too late. All I need is one last ingredient, something sharp. Right. You got it, sir. Now I will, uh, I'll grab the bread. And I will not throw it out the front door this time. That seems like... That seems like a good idea. Hey! What have you done? You've ruined my potion. I'll show you what happens to those who try to escape. Was I popped? Hey. Where did you go? Oh, I see. You want to play hide and seek? Well, ready or not, here I come. Oh? Okay, saw, plus spoon, plus jack in the box, plus reindeer equals key. I want the key. The key sounds good. Toast plus fire plus plant plus orange equals mirror is now broken candy plus ice plus pear plus remote equals confused frog sweet ice green remote this is correct Right, that's the death curse. Okay, toast. I want the key. Clearly, I want the key. So, sharp spoon, toy, deer. Okay. Oh. What do we have here? The harvester, daily noodle. Four more go missing. Harvester, uh, harvester has long been a town of quaint charm and cheerful ambiance. But in recent months, a sinister cloud has cast over the shadow. A shadow over the beloved community. The culprit? None other than the enigmatic harvester laboratory. You guys can read that if you want. Bone saw. Yes, I need the saw. Can I just put this down? I don't think I should drop this. Okay, into the cauldron. Come out, come out, wherever you are. Oh, I don't love this. I hide? Oh, I don't know if you can hide. Harvester Laboratory Experiment Report. Experiment aimed to explore the side effects of XZ17 on cognitive functions and behavioral response in the context of virtual reality training simulations. The objective was to assess the 
feasibility of using immersive experiences to influence decision making and responsiveness in controlled environments. Procedure. Subject HL221 participated in a series of virtual reality training sessions utilizing cutting edge gaming technology. During, during these sessions, Serum XZ17 was administered to redacted within the simulated environments. Results Cognitive enhancement in virtual environments. Post administration, uh, subject HL221 demonstrated redacted responses within the virtual reality environment. Redacted suggests potential applications for training and skill development. Behavioral adaptation. Subject HL221 displayed a heightened responsiveness to virtual stimuli, adapting behavioral based on simulated scenarios. The integration of redacted with virtual reality training showed promise in influencing behavioral patterns within controlled environments. Physical well-being. Virtual vital signs and physical health parameters redacted were observed during or after the virtual reality training sessions. Hmm. Conclusion. The results of experiment HL221 suggest that the integration of serum XZ17 with virtual reality training has potential applications in redacted within simulated environments. The findings open avenues of, for further research into the development of innovative training method, methodologies. Note, this report emphasizes the potential positive applications of the experiment within controlled and ethical contexts. Oh, here's my deer skull. Oh, I can't put the back, can I? Oh, but scary things are going to happen. In the pot. What else do I need? A toy and a spoon. Oh, lovely family fix. Is that Nick Cage? You know, that might just be an overexposed picture of Nick Cage. Nothing in here. Where's my pet? Oh. Why? Wait, I want... I want the paper. No, let me... Entity Remora. Entity named Remora is a relatively harmless entity. It refers to itself as Santiago and prefers the company of other entities. Its appearance is that of a large floating mass of organics. When diagnostics have been run on the organic material matter, the breakdown has come back as redacted and redacted. When it comes to Remora's preferences on other entities, there are a handful that it has been seen with. However, it overall seems to prefer the company of entity Dream Eater the most. It escapes its enclosure regularly to voluntarily break into Dream Eater's enclosure. It has been noted that Remora will insert itself into the minds of Dream Eater's victims. It has the, build, it has the ability to interact, but it does not appear to harm the victims. While inside the hypnosis, Remora is often given the appearance of a kiwi-colored kiwi bird. When we find this to be because of redacted, redacted, redacted. Gotcha. Alright, I got a lovely, lovely jack in the box now. Now, a spoon? Just need a spoon? The heartbeats continue. Door is locked. Flipboard. 
Entity Dream Eater, that's the frog, right? Entity named Dream Eater refers to itself as Diag Diego. Appearance is redacted redacted. It lures victims into a dreamlike state, giving them a false sense of happiness and security in this state. It should appear to victims as a small frog-like amphibian, setting them on a small quest. Uh, in reality, it is redacted, 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 redacted. If victims should obey Dream Eater, then the entity can successfully devour the victim's soul and body, leaving no physical trace behind. However, if victims disobey Dream Eater, the entity cannot control its rage. It will show its true form. To pacify Dream Eater, one has to redacted, 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 Contact with the Dream Eater is highly limited, as this is a Class S entity, and should under no circumstances be interacted with by unprotected personnel. Well, uh, I think, uh, I think we might have a problem. What's that? Oh, a lovely skull. It is... It's not following me. It is Halloween after all. Key? Where do you think you're going? Out. Out the door. Frozen? Oh, I hate that. Oh, I hate that. Please? Please? Okay, I think that's the good ending. Is as good. <laughs> hey, little buddy. As good as uh, as good as it could have been. Oh, I forgot. That was it. Toy factory. Oh, right, because the. <laughs> The, the the Christmas update. Yes. Oh, I mean, you mean the laboratory, of course. Harvester Labs. I think I'm starting to remember. Ending three of three. Oh, disobedient. Wonderful. Well, that was I forgot. Uh, thank you all so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, all that fun jazz. Oh, excuse me. And yeah, leave a comment down below. Um, and yeah, thank you so much for watching up to this point. Um, and if you want to give me money, uh, I do have my Patreon down below. It is completely voluntary. It's not necessary, but it does help me get games like this that cost money. And I do appreciate everyone that has already donated and helped me on this venture. Um, and yeah, I will see you next one. Have a good day.